Hey, so this is a, a video to show you how you can render with Husk, the um, the utility that lets you um, render a USD file using Karma or any renderer that um, supports Hydra. So if you can check the documentation here, um, I'll put that link in the description, but basically in a shell, so this is my terminal, you can use husk, then options, then feed it a USD file and it will render out um, your USD. So I've got this um, simple graph and I've got three different USDs. So this one is just, uh, it's always the same. It's a grid and then uh, some kind of geo. So there's a sphere, there's a cube, and then there's a pyramid. So you can do husk and I've already copied it. So that's the path to my USD, that's the USD sphere. So if I click enter, it's gonna render. And then if I go to render test, then I've got the sphere right here. Um, you've got other options, like for example, you can use the uh, and play monitor option and then resolution. Those are overrides that you can input uh, there over here, for example. Um, this is just an example. So I'm using the uh, and play monitor then with the C argument, which is um, the image plane you want to visualize. And then I'm overriding the resolution as you can see here. Um, so if I now launch this command, then uh, and play will pop up, and uh, here's my result. Um, this allows you to do stuff like um, you could set up a bash script which launches Houdini and then renders out the USDs. So I'm just gonna save this file and close Houdini. Um, if I go to this terminal, so there you can see the script. So it's just, I've declared an array with all my USDs and then it's um, CD to the Houdini directory sourcing the setup and then calling husk on all the elements of my array over here. So if I now do source husk auto.sh and it's gonna initialize the Houdini environment and then it's gonna render out um, all three USDs. So if I go now to render test husk, then I've got my cube, I've got the pyramid, and I've got the sphere as well. Um, now we can launch Houdini again, and I'm going to show you how you can do the same with tops, because um, you might not want to use bash. Uh, and tops is kind of a nicer interface interface so I'm gonna so I've got this top net and I've got this file pattern which is referencing all my USDs on disk so if I go to geotest husk I've got all three USDs set up here and then I can use the generic generator and then call the husk command and it's so I've set it to single, so it runs sequentially and not everything at the same time. So if I now, uh, I'm gonna delete these. And um, I'm gonna run this. So now it's gonna render all three. So now if I come here, then I've got the cube again, the pyramid, 
and then the sphere. And there you go. That's how you can use Husk to render USD with Karma. But you could use like any other Hydro Delegate. So, yeah, cool.